Learning Spanish not only will enhance your resume, but it will really get you to apprehend, understand, and share different views of the world. Spanish is the second most spoken language by native speakers in the world, with more than 400 million Spanish speakers in 23 countries. Spanish is considered one of the easiest languages to learn. Do you recognize these places? You know who they are? Have you tried these food? Wanting to watch animation without subtitle and to play games in Japanese? These are all good motivations and a Japanese language class can help you with your wishes. Welcome. My name is Rastin Mehri and I uh, teach two major languages in the Middle East, Persian and Arabic. There are very different languages, one of them being a member of the Afro-Asiatic languages or Semitic, and Persian being an Indo-European language. They're wonderful languages, amazing structures, and really fun. Very much look forward to seeing you. Hello, I'm the teacher of German. Classes go from basic beginners to advanced level classes. And I try to teach you a skill that can get you um, to Germany, Austria, Switzerland, and you can use that skill to communicate with the Germans, the Austrians, and the Swiss people um, for work, traveling, exchange, any such things. So whatever your plans are for the future, knowledge of German will increase your options. Italian at SFU offers language and culture courses from the 100 to the 400 level and the possibility of completing an Italian minor. Italian language is easier than you think. Italian words are everywhere. Some of them are part of our everyday life, like pizza or latte. Italian is the standard language used in music, opera and design. Italy is Europe's third largest economy and the Italian language is spoken by over 85 million people. It is also the fourth most studied language in the world. Courses in our program can satisfy a few distribution requirements such as breadth and above all they can acquaint you with a language and a culture that are as beautiful as they are rich in history and tradition. In the Punjabi language courses you will be introduced to the Punjabi script Gurmukhi, along with several grammatical rules which will help facilitate an understanding of basic reading and writing skills. You will also be introduced to Punjabi conversational skills and learn about Punjabi culture, traditions and values. Punjabi is not only a course that has academic benefits but also is of great use in the real world. In the Lower Mainland, having even basic Punjabi language skills is a great asset in the job market. Therefore, learning about Punjabi culture and community will be of great use for experiencing and exploring Punjabi festivals, events, and culture. What can you do if you take one Chinese course? What will you learn? You will learn Mandarin pronunciation and tones. You will learn basic Chinese character strokes to write Chinese characters. You learn to read and write about 120 Chinese characters. Oh, you will also learn how to do Chinese word processing. Hence, you can send simple Chinese text messages, email messages. Having learned all that, you would be able to do a cool self-introduction, all in Mandarin Chinese. You'll be able to ask for basic information from other people, their names, where they're from, their studies, their work. See, you can do quite a lot with what you have learned in just one course. Imagine how much more you can do with two or more Chinese courses. I'll see you in one of my Chinese classes. What can you expect from taking the Greek language courses? Throughout the different levels, there will be references to the ancient and modern Greek culture an introduction to concepts emerging from the Greek world, access to new and exciting educational technology prepared by members of the academic community and the SNF New Media Lab, courses that lead to certificates. Need more information? Visit the website 
of world languages and literatures to find out more.